Here's an idea, fellas. Why don't we stick <laughs> our? Uh, well, wow, you can. Wow, well, you can. Have, you can actually you know, watch the air expanding, and actually watch the flow. Have you know that? Yeah, it's, it's buoyancy. Yeah, yeah, you can see the buoyancy. Anyway, so we take a job. Just dried that out. We get a bag of poly as we do, and. Uh, We'll see how we go, fellas. I don't know. It's going to go all sort of electrostatic on us or something. I just want to see if the ratio still holds. You know, for this. Oh, okay. We get a little bit of fluff in there, fellas. You know. You know, we're at the beginning of the journey. You've got to start somewhere, and you know. And you can just do it over and over again. But we have got ratios to work towards or get up against. I might actually just to make the thing simpler because this does tamp down a bit is why don't we just you know tamp it down so we got it's easier to work this way fellas you can always tamp something down but it's hard to okay so we've got one of these like that like that with the poly some fancy uh, you know okay maybe we need the spot colour I don't know one in maybe we'll put it on the spot color now for the second go and we'll see how we go okay yeah, one, one. yeah well, i think we already were on spot color okay well, let's just go back to normal then go back the other way and i think i'm actually running out of my poly i think this might be the only one i can run with this sort of thing from all those years ago graded out using my machine you might want to look up my machine the clip's not wonderful, but um, it shows you my... I've still got my sieve plate, so I could always get one made up, you know. If you win some mathematical prize for solving, some, uh, uh, you know, prime numbers or something. You know, is it 6x plus or minus 1 minus the 9 primes or something like that? So, um, hint, hint. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, I know, you know, everyone thinks, you know. So what's the first one that falls out? It's 25. Okay, is that somehow associated with the 9 prime? <laughs> and is the 9 prime on the other side of the hexagon that splits the, the two lines exactly down the middle? Yeah, okay. What, what is primeness? Yeah. Okay. okay, we'll put this one in here like that. Now, it's probably too hot to waggle around, but we'll waggle it around or whatever we can. If I don't know, I'm going to burn myself. Or if I do it lightly, get some of the heat out. Maybe we can use the jar to help us. Because I don't think it's gonna to stick too much with that sort of thing. And we'll see. Is the ratio still valid? Does it still hold? Or do we need more poly? Do you think that's gonna be, is it coming together fellas? Does that look like a good ratio for poly? And if we assume that the the cellulose there, you know, the newspaper cellulose is a bit like peat in a way, consistency and in quotes aeration, well it's not going to be aerated if it, it can actually self-generate some reductive flammable gas and then the poly when it after two weeks starts it's a, to actually self-generate and continue that generation whereas before it used to run out after two weeks yes so is it like a a triggered chain reaction sort of thing or is there some sort of relationship which starts happening with the organs I don't know but anyway we'll see what happens but uh, I might want to keep that in there just to and we'll we'll get it refined like that so is it a good does that look good or not or do we have to have with newspaper cellulose instead of peat we got to have um, three parts poly I don't know these things we're going to learn. The next one we can make up, we can, well, I said I'm running out of this stuff. Oh, I might just have enough to. No, I'm not sure, fellas. I may have to start grinding some more by hand, which is not the best, but uh, it's not as well graded as this. So anyway, we'll see how we go. So once that's defrosted, which will probably be quite rapidly in another five minutes or so, once uh, that warmth has gone right the way through it, I'll, I'll rub that in, rub that in. 
uh, <laughs> run that out. <laughs> um, and then we'll pot, pot it into a nice pot and we'll stick it on our thing. And if it pinks in four days or something, or goes much better, or even red reddens up or something, we'll know we're probably on the money and we're getting cl much closer. And um, actually, silicate has been a negative or something. We haven't been able to get those big fat red roots and root hairs on the um, things like common things like capensis, which is going to be the indicator plant, surely. Everyone's got capensis. If this works, everyone can do this. And that just immediately highlights the whole world. There's the problem, here's the answer. And the revolution begins, basically. We now know what's going on. We need to have some form of uh, reductive flammable gas generation. So we don't want to store it. We just want to have it on a continual regular a sm uh, continual uh, generation sort of thing. Uh, you, we may be able to use polyurethane for home, that's a much better, more gentle store in a way, a catch and release, store and release sort of thing, I don't know, but um, we'll see how we go. But um, I think that's enough for this video, I've done enough for this one. But uh, I can't really, I don't think I've got anything else to talk about really, apart from the fact that this one over here, taking less water but the water seems to be taking longer to infiltrate so oh, oh yeah we've got some flies they're getting rather interested so I'm not on spot colour unfortunately but uh, yeah we interesting as I said it looks like they're growing about a centimetre a day these pictures maybe they'll get faster I don't know but so far it's about a centimetre a day so you know give it another two weeks 14 days and they should be 14 centimetres higher which is 15 centimetres about there so you know well, well hang on we do know a milk bottle from the line up, up to that line point there is 15 centimetres because that makes 101.5 litres so you know about so in two weeks it should be up there three weeks it'll be up where the red cap is so um, yeah there we go anyway over and out for this video see ya